I'm Jane Esselstyn. I'm Ann Esselstyn. And we are talking about the Prevent Inverse Heart Disease Cookbook on this YouTube channel. But today we're going to talk about the origins of it, which are my mom and dad's book. My dad's book, but my mom did the majority of it of the recipes. And one of the recipes that she's doing today, it's is it it's not like well, it's called fried zucchini. However, it's way simpler what I do right now. You can add other things, but yeah, this we has are five ingredients. This has two. We are just laden with zucchini at this time of year. Not only from our garden, but from the CSA Italian version. <laughs> Celebrating zucchini again this week. Okay. So. I take a zucchini and I cut the ends off and then I cut it in thirds and and, and if I can in, in, in more because the end pieces I don't love as much but so I've got it like that and then I put it in a pan and the fun thing is lots of zucchini are kind of um, have ends like this that are sort of little, they, they go along the sides of the pan nicely. Oh, they bow like a banana. Yeah. You know what these are called in Europe, the yellow ones? Courgette? Yes. I love that name. Courgette. So I've put this all, all uh, everything facing down now. And uh, then no, I am. You're out of Right. Oh. I am then going to take some vinegar and I am just going to go like this. The acid queen strikes again. And you know, maybe kind of make sure it's everywhere. The finger technique. And then, yeah, finger technique. <laughs> and then on the stove, and it simply co cooks. Um, for maybe five minutes aside. Well, let's turn it on then. And you flip it over, give it another little vinegar. What uh, temperature do you want to have it on? Medium high, or start on high. And then, um, well, well, wait a minute. We'll wait until it. Wait until they're ready. Wow! It is sizzling on the sizzling on the stove. And uh, it takes maybe five minutes. I, I actually, I'm not sure because I can check them and see if they're all nice and brown underneath. And actually, usually, I would start these, this skin side down. Uh, I mean, I, but, but no, it's all right. Any way you do it, it doesn't really matter because I'm going to flip them. There's many ways to skin a zucchini. All right, we, you just have to wait uh, five minutes. Uh, is it, you know, you can peek and see, and oh. it's looking nice and brown. Flip look them. Look at those. Those look delicious. Isn't that great? Wow. We turn it down a little bit. It's smoking up a storm. Medium hot. Yep. These are like slabs of... Well, they're slabs of squash and zucchini. Courgette. But they're like, you could eat them like slabs of, uh, <coughs> of meat or cheese in a sandwich. You can. And if you need to have a little more, you can. Some of these seem fine. But that little bit of vinegar just gives them a nice taste. And, and a smell. I mean, uh, it's crazy. I mean, this is just enough for one person, practically. They're so good when they're done. <laughs> and one of the things that we've done that we love is I have put them in a bowl with greens and beans and rice and cut them up and then put a sauce on top, and it's delicious. So have fun with them, but they are really delicious just by themselves. Oh. Aren't they gorgeous? They are gorgeous. Now, now, the one I like the best is this one because it's kind of skinny. But you can see how both sides are nice. Now, what what I like to do is to cut. See, you get this is if you cut a little bit off that, it still it tastes just the same. So but the, it wouldn't too much skin. You don't can't get too much. Not a lot of contact. Don't. But these are so good. I of course would use them in the uh, well-known zucchini sandwich. Put layer them in a sandwich. 
and put on everything else that you'd like in the sandwich with hummus and tomatoes and greens and scallions or put them in. You made that beautiful bowl um, yeah. the other day with these lining the bottom of the bowl. And of course, as she mentioned earlier, this, how many, how many does this serve? It serves one. One, but you can cut them up like this. Are we going to taste them? Yeah. Oh, sure. great. Hey, you guys got to taste them too. But anyway, when, it's, when zucchini are Smoking just hot. overwhelming the world, this is the best way to use them up. It's good. It's simple. It's hot. And it's hot. <laughs> yeah, go fry up some zucchini. <laughs> Say goodbye.